Hello, Scorpio. It's Milady from Milady's Way Tarot. And I'm coming to do your weekly love reading mm -hmm, for the week of April 12th through the 19th, 2021. The cards I'm using today are Oracle of Visions by Kiro Marchetti. And I'm closing off with my Tarot of Haunted House by Sasha Graham. I want to thank everybody for like, sharing, subscribing, and setting up personal readings with me. All right, Morphos, let's get this show on the road. All right, what's going on with the Scorpio? Scorpio, 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 what's going on? What's going on? What's going on? All All right, so we got card number three here. So it looks like somebody is getting ready to escape some kind of situation, okay? Somebody is getting ready to move forward to, like, pursue their dreams, okay? Hopes and dreams, okay? Mm-hmm. A lot of meditation going on. Lovely. So we got card number 21 here. So I do feel like somebody's getting kind of lucky. Um, I do feel like things are getting ready to start happening, okay? Good things are on their way. Um, somebody's just getting about to get all kinds of lucky. Like, how did I miss that? You know, how did I get this? Like, what made me do this? Okay. All right. So I do feel like somebody has a lot of stuff going on, planning a lot of things, a lot of things coming, a lot of things going. Okay. I do feel like somebody's stressed out. Okay. I do feel like somebody is uh, trying to let go of something that happened in the past, but can't really let it go. Okay. So it's just like, a, you know, I'm trying to get over what this food and did to me, but I just can't let it go. Okay. I just can't let it go. All right. So we got card number eight reversed here. So this makes me feel like, oh, I feel like somebody was dealing with someone that held them back. Okay. I feel like I was held back. I feel like somebody just tried to break up my process of doing stuff i feel like i had all these ideas all these wants all these needs and i was dealing with somebody who was stopping me from doing this okay but i don't know where this person at but i know now it's just like a i'm going for it no matter if you're here or not okay but i don't feel the energy of the person there so i do feel like that person may be gone okay but i do feel like like i'm not letting go of what they did though I do feel like that's stopping me from moving forward, too. Okay, so I guess since it's getting warm outside, people bringing their uh, sounds out. But, uh, yeah. All right, so we got card number 38 here. So I do feel like um, somebody got a lot of stuff going on here. And I do feel like somebody needs to take some time to relax, okay? Take some time to relax, to figure out what's happening, to actually get out whatever this person did you know i do feel like somebody may have stolen a lot of time from you uh but i do feel like just um somebody doing a little bit of dwelling and i do feel like you're still gonna be moving forward but i do feel like this is hindering you okay i mean this happened to me as well and what i did is like you know everything that happened to me all that information i use it to help other people okay and maybe that's the reason you got it as well but i know it's easier said than done to hey take this information and run with it you know you got to actually see it know it believe it and then you got to see it in action okay so i know it's a long process but i know you gonna get there but i definitely see a lot of success here lots of success okay I do feel like somebody feels like their time is wasting away. Oh, wow. All right. So I do feel like, yeah, it's hard for somebody me need to go talk to somebody like a specialist. Because uh, even though somebody is moving forward, somebody is doubting themselves. Okay. They're not able to get away from what this person has said to them. It's just keep playing in their head. Like even though that success is coming, I do feel like it's still playing in your head. Okay. It's still playing in your head that or whatever you can't do. Like, oh, wow, this happened to me like 20 years ago. Uh, one of my first partners told me that I would never be able to become an FBI agent. And I believed that for a long time. And, I mean, it may not be too late, but I don't know. what My 
yeah, maybe, <laughs> maybe it is. But it's just like when somebody says something to you and it's like so crazy, it, it may, it stays in there. So definitely need to talk to somebody about this, you know, to let you know, shoot, if you really want it, you can do it. And I do feel like with this 21 being your top card, now is definitely the time because whatever you put your hands on right now is turning to gold, okay? Definitely gold mine. All right, of course. You feel people from the past, they're going to try to contact you. Let me pick this up here. So I do feel like this person that you was dealing with that was trying to make you feel like you're not good enough, you can't do it, they're going to try to contact you, okay? And I do feel like... I feel like I'm moving for if this person is there or not, but I do feel like this person is going to do whatever in their power to not let you succeed, okay? Because they feel like, I, they just don't feel like you should be better than them. That's the energy that I'm feeling. They want to try to stop you. Oh, you sure you don't want to come over here? Oh, yeah, I planned this on this day. I didn't know you had meetings, you know, just that kind of stuff. A whole lot of that, ooh, Make me want to put my hands around somebody's neck kind of thing, okay? Not in a good way, all right? That's that's what's going on here. So if this person reach out to you, I, of course, it's not going to be for nothing good, okay? Or anything that benefits them. This person doesn't believe you're supposed to be better than them, okay? In any way. They don't want you to succeed. They want you to look up to them. Ugh. Okay. All right, let's see what's going on with these Haunted House cards. Tarot of Haunted House, Pierre Federici, and Sasha Graham. All right. All right, what's going on? What's going on? What's going on? Scorpio, Scorpio, Scorpio. Oh, one of my puppies stayed in here with me. All right. All right, so we got the tower card reversed here. Yeah, so sudden destruction. Somebody is rebuilding after all this, okay? All right, so we got the lover's card here. Oh, goodness. So I do feel like somebody has a lot of choices to make, but I do feel like somebody is getting ready to or are in a relationship where there is definitely love there, okay? But it's crazy. I can still feel and hear things from previous persons playing in my head, Okay. So we got the high priestess reversed here. So I do feel like some kind of secrets is getting ready to come out. And I do feel like it's this ex trying to contact you. This person from before. It's probably don't even have to be an ex. Just this person before from before trying to contact you. Okay, good. It's getting ready to get out. All right. Oh, goodness. All right. So it's also looking like somebody may be starting something new. I do feel pregnancy energy as well here. Okay. So somebody could be pregnant, not telling anybody, um, or somebody just started this new relationship. This is real love. I do see marriage, but I do see happiness definitely here. But of course, when you're happy, it always somebody from the past trying to mess that up. Okay. But definitely somebody new and I do feel love here. All right, so we got the Six of Pentacles reversed here. Um, so this makes me feel like somebody is feeling like they're being used, okay? And I do feel like this got that energy of that previous person. It's just like you contact this person, this person likes you. So, or this person just want to control you. So, of course, they're going to tell you the person that you're dealing with now that you love and love you, that envy and that that unhappiness for you and your relationship, they're going to try to tell you things that's going to break that up. So this person is trying to make you believe that this new person is um, using you even though this person loves you because they want to make their way back in and try to break up everything that you got going, okay? Or just try to live off what you got. They don't want you to go any further. This is good enough. You know, whatever you're doing now, even though you got all these other plans, this is good enough. I want to take this from you, Okay, and of course, they're going to leave you with nothing. Let's see what this high priest does. Reverse one card, please, for the Scorpio. All right, so we got the nine of swords revert, uh, up right here. So I do feel like, yeah, somebody's been having nightmares about this situation. Okay, ever since this person from the past contacted you, you just having all these crazy weird thoughts about this new person that you never thought before because you don't believe this. It's all coming from that previous person mm -hmm. 
All right, so we got the Ace of Wands reversed here. So yeah, I do feel like this person, this previous person, don't want you to start nothing new with this new person, okay? Of course, they jealous of everything you do. It's crazy because you would think this was just somebody off a rival of uh, baseball team or some kind of team that you used to play that you end up uh, living next door to. It's just like it's a game for this person to try to stop you from success, okay? Mm -mm. All right, so we got the four of pentacles reversed here. I do feel like you're getting ready to be in a time and a place where you can put money up and... um. Your money ain't wrapped up all over the place, okay? And everything that's yours is yours, okay? But if you let this previous person come back in, everything that you built this far, definitely believe that they're going to take it down, okay? But everything is up to you, and that's all I have for you guys. Make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs. Thanks for watching.